All right, so we are in Harston Woods, which is not your typical trailer park. It's more of a um, mobile home community, which is a, a much better word for it. And this is where we started looking when we got the idea of getting our own properties when we were about to leave the apartment. And I actually stumbled upon this for some reason by accident and noticed that these places, these um, mobile homes were brand new. The, the whole neighborhood is growing. Um, it's all new. And so we just decided to swing by and take a look. And there is one particular street that we were interested in called Lob Lolly Lane, which we love the name. And uh, it was close by work. And um, the fact that it was a quiet community made a big difference. As you can tell, all these properties are showing uh, indications of growth. And across on the left, we see, um, left and right, we see that the properties are, are ready for uh, the mobile homes installations. So we, we see that um, we're gonna turn the corner in a moment to the left and take a look at some homes that caught our interest. And it's not the same street, but it's the same concept. So we're gonna take a look in this second. But as you can tell, this whole neighborhood is open for business. We see some traditional streets already done and we're gonna go by the house, uh, the mobile home that I was actually looking for in case, um, you know, before we what we um, found the house that we're in now. So I'll get out and take a, and show you around. All right, sorry for the sun flare, but the house that my wife and I were actually interested in and is still for sale is this one. We actually would have preferred a corner unit, but this is not a bad idea. I'm gonna see if I can go in and just take a look, but take a look. This looks like a, a regular traditional home. It's got a little porch. We would have preferred that porch over there. But this one has what we are looking for. It has a nice little, I love the door and I love the view. No neighbors, <laughs> no neighbors. Now this one has air conditioning already. And this one is basically up for grabs. And when, uh, when we decide to actually buy something, we'll swing by here again. But this is what we were looking for the first time. It's very well decorated, it's small yard. There's no um, huge yard to cut. So there you go, if you're interested. And no, I'm not getting any commission from this. But the air conditioning unit's there. There's the back door. They have parking in the back for two cars. This is the house that I would have preferred. And this one actually has a long porch. And I really do love a porch, especially when you have a view. That's another house that they're building now. Sorry for the sun, sorry guys. And all that lot is still, still up for grabs. So if we want to downsize, this is where we would like to have gone. The only thing that, we there are wasps here. No, thank you. <laughs> so this is basically something that I would have considered. The only thing that stopped us is when they decided to tell us that they were going to um, charge rent for the land itself. So didn't appreciate that part, but it is what it is. So. We didn't want to mortgage and rent on, to on top of each other. But this is not a bad alternative, you know, depending on your budget. And when we decide to downside, I will still, still consider it. But I'd rather have the mobile home on my own property. So that's what I would prefer. Again, if you're in the market for a home and don't have a multi-million dollar budget like me, this is not a bad alternative. And the homes are of high quality. They're very spacious for what you would pay for a traditional home. They're very spacious. And I would do this in a heartbeat. Yeah, so this house I really like. I really like this one as far as the porch is concerned. But the windows on the other one I really like. And look at Yami driving and recording. <laughs> See? 
All right, now, as you can see, this is a very nice community. Um, it looks like it's very quiet, very clean. Um, and you can tell that uh, it's been lived in as, as far as this part's concerned. So we are gonna go um, around so you can see the back of the homes. And they each each house has, um, I like to give that. Uh, each house has some place to park the car and they have a little um, shed. So that come, apparently comes standard from what I can tell. And um, the people just have to take care of their own um, grass and stuff like that, but it's not that much. As you can tell, there's a variety of different types of homes here and there's nothing that's the same throughout. So at least it's not like cookie cutter. And those, as you can tell, there are no garages here per se, but there are carports. You know, you have to get your own carport. So some of these have um, carports and some don't, but that's okay. In Texas, it's a good idea to have a carport because we have a, a tendency to have <laughs> hailstorms, which kind of destroy everything. Oh, this is cool. They got a barrel on there, so I didn't want to show the license. But uh, there's a house that has a barrel at the end of the, um, I forgot what you call those, the, the drain for the water when it rains. So, but as you can tell, there's still space just enough for one car here, but um, it's not bad. So if you are in the market to purchase a home and you don't have, and you don't have um, enough to you know, put down on a traditional home. This is an, a very good alternative. It's a very nice, quiet neighborhood. And um, if it weren't for the fact that um, they rent the land, I would have purchased one in a heartbeat. Okay, I like to get that. So, and I also would have preferred a house that's on the corner. So we're gonna go around just to show you this. Dos a la derecha. So these homes have been here for a while. So as you can tell, there's different styles. Um, one thing I have noticed that in common that the rooms are very large here. So this is on Timberland Trail that we're looking at and we're coming off of Loblolly Lane because I love the name. But as you can tell, see all this land, this is all mobile home ready, all mobile home ready. All the um, tubes are ready for the plumbing and uh, not bad, not bad at all. All right, so now you have an idea of why we wanted to live here in Harston Woods community. It's a very nice community, mobile home uh, community. Um, the price is perfect for what I was looking for, looking to spend. And But like I said, the only thing that stopped us in our own personal situation was the fact that they uh, rent the land and I personally don't want to rent the land. I don't want to pay rent on top of my mortgage. That's just me. If that works out for you, by all means, give them a call. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. And no, I'm not getting a commission. But if I ever were to move here, I would claim that. <laughs> so, so. All right, D.R. Horton is still building. So start buying these houses. Okay, so. Now we're in the new development in traditional homes. And they're for sale. These are D.R. Horton properties. And um, the neighborhood is growing like crazy. Everywhere you look, there's new houses, there's new construction. Now the new places are built with tankless heating, tankless water heaters. They also have um, hardwood floors, whereas when we built ours, it wasn't available. So this nice corner house. Maybe the owners just watching out. Maybe, yeah. 
yeah, these, what, oh no, these are people picking up scraps, that's what they're doing. They're picking up the garbage that's left behind from the construction. That's okay, you can, they can resell it, make some money. Can't say I blame them. Yeah. Yeah, so yes, all these are new houses. It's still under construction, obviously. Brings back memories of when we went through this process. Uh, good, they got the air, they're connecting the gas on that house because that's from Atmos Energy. Mm -hmm. I like it, this. Yes, I like this too. Yes. Oh, I like nice. I like the entrance of this yes. one. Yeah. Mm, See, nice. and even beyond there, they're going to be building. Mm -hmm. So. Looking for a, a home that's reasonably priced. Give D.R. Horton a look see. And they're they're located in the far part of North Fort Worth. Um, if you're in Dallas. So this is basically the neighborhood. These are pretty solid. And that's the same style of house we have right here. So they're putting down the, the driveway on this one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they're not quite cookie cutter. They have different designs next to each other so that there's not uh, this repetition. Mm -hmm. It's pretty well planned out in my opinion. So, and the houses are going very quickly. The houses are going very quickly. So with depending on what your budget is, you can buy a traditional home like this one, or... Do you want to Alright, so if you want to get something, now's the time to do it. They don't, they don't mm -hmm. drive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, so it's a very nice area. I'll try not to show any street names or numbers. This is very nice. So the new neighbors have moved in for the most part. Uh, a lot of houses are showing sold. Some are still available. You need to snatch these up quickly and make our that HOA is. fees go down because <laughs> there's more people. So, but yeah, so this is, this is nice. This is all done, sold. Available. Okay, this one's still available. Nice. So there's a lot going on here. Sold, sold, sold. Yep, sold. All oh, this sold. between the, from my perspective, the mobile homes versus these, you're actually owning the whole thing, the property as well as the house are yours. And I'm sure there's other places you can actually just buy property and put a house on there, which is what I would have preferred to do, to have done. And call it a day, but this is not a bad idea for our first house. learn. See? See all the different houses? They have two stories. They have one story. Mostly one stories. The two stories are pretty big. We've been in the model home and it was very nice. However, and there's people walking dogs, of course. A lot of people that don't walk nice. their dogs here. But, um, yeah. This is highly recommended. This is D.R. Horton Express Homes in Fort Worth. I'll leave the link in the description. Give them a, a look-see.